so hi guys this is my garden this year I've tried to personalize it even more I got some more busy leases colorful ones this year so we've got some reds we've got some pinks we've got some whites that's what it looks like and I've got my shells hanging and making beautiful noise with the wind blowing I got my my basket of full of begonias and on this side and this year there's a surprise for you guys I'm growing some plants so from scratch like that I'm also growing some seeds this rose I cut last year and look where we are not even last year in winter and it's growing so fast and inside this we've got some marigold we've got some dentists we've got some California puppies and there I've got more busy lizzies for you and this is how it's looking I've got some ivy English ivy and in that pot we've got some mint and I'm trying to grow all sorts of things including um, sunflowers and um, yeah I forgot to show you um, my uh, parsley's so I got cut curly parsley's and I've got uh, normal ordinary parsley's as well so that's it for inside my balcony the other side of the balcony and in these hanging baskets we've got some begonias some some I think busy lizzies and so many other things growing inside this small hanging basket and inside my tree right here I've got some cherry tomatoes growing right here and more busy lizzies very colorful very nice and fresh you remember that I had last year I've got some geraniums all sorts of geraniums growing on this side some rose <clears throat> but the, the real beauty the real beauty lies here with the pioneers that are just breathtaking gorgeous flowers that are just good looking they look good for the camera and they look good in real life here's what one of my favorite roses growing right here amazing These are my pennies, our pioneers, and here comes 
the gorgeous rose it's just blooming non-stop and I'm here for it so here we've got some um, daisies you'll see more at the end of the garden and I've got some oriental lilies right there and they're just growing non-stop I thank God they grew back I put them in the ground last summer and in winter they died and then they just came back in in spring so I'm very happy about that in the big baskets right there we've got some strawberries growing strawberries and in that small basket we've got some supertunias or petunias growing alongside some begonias there we've also got some busy lizzies in the basket over there and as you can see i'm trying to lean the roses against the balcony so that they will grow and cover they'll grow and cover the balcony just the vision i has for i have for it so fingers crossed you know i keep feeding my roses making sure they don't lie lack on water or anything i've also planted some um sunflowers back this year these are the rest of the sunflowers from last year <clears throat> someone told me they were perennials but they never came back to life so i've planted some new sunflowers but this time i've planted them next to the fence so here i've got some cute sweet williams or the antis and the variety is just out of this world and the colors it's just mind-blowing so I have all sorts of colors white pink orange you name it and I like their velvety look we have about them they just look glorious breathtaking beautiful We've got more red roses and they are climbing the arch. Hopefully, one day they will be as tall as the arch. And then we've got some oriental lilies. And then here, the daisies. And I'm growing sunflowers. As you can see, they just started to come out and I can't wait to see them grow tall and beautiful and breathtaking so yeah I hope you enjoyed watching me show you my garden my pretty summer garden and inside of my balcony so here we are everything looks so amazing